Are you an introvert? Have you ever wondered what an introvert would like to hear once in a while? Just like any other person, introverts need to hear encouraging words once in a while. Maybe even more so because we tend to be a bit more sensitive than others. If you're wondering how to make your introverted family member or friend's day, keep watching. Without further ado, here are 9 things that introverts would like to hear. Number 1. Words of Appreciation Due to their introversion, introverts tend to look for ways to get things done behind the scenes so as not to get the spotlight shone on them. Unfortunately, that leads to much of their work or achievements going unnoticed and unappreciated. This becomes a pattern for everything they do, including when helping friends or family. The help they give goes unnoticed or begins to be expected. There comes a time when introverts feel invisible. A few words of appreciation can light up an introvert's world because it makes them feel seen and like their effort was not wasted. It also makes them feel like they are actually doing something good instead of just not being sure due to not getting any type of feedback. Number 2. Are you okay? Introverts don't generally get asked if they are alright due to their quietness and stillness. This stillness is often seen by others as something good because they think that being still means being at peace. This is not always the case, so when someone asks an introvert how they are, it truly makes their day. This act also lets the introvert know that someone is actively looking out for them and cares. The silence and sometimes standoffish way of the introverts means that not many people approach them and they feel alone. Someone asking if they are alright lets them know that there are people that can accept them for who they are and care about them. Number 3. Compliment the way they think. Introverts think a lot, often to the point of overthinking. This happens because of observation and wanting to do the right thing on the part of the introvert. Introverts are observers, and they spend vast amounts of time absorbing information on the conscious and unconscious levels. This enables them to accurately know things about others, even though they rarely say anything. All the information they absorb is then analysed in several different ways, mainly to see it through different perspectives. It is very satisfying when someone acknowledges the mental and emotional work that introverts put into their thoughts. Number 4. I love the way you are. You can always see other people being praised for their extroverted personalities. If you're an introvert, it is very rare that people take the time to get to know you. What is most valued in today's society is the outward qualities a person can demonstrate. For us introverts, this makes us feel like an outcast and like we need to change in order to develop the connections that we see others have. Being praised for being the way we are lets us know that there is absolutely nothing wrong with being an introvert and that we don't have to change if we don't want to, which is a big relief for us. Number 5. Thank you for your insight. As thinkers, introverts work very hard to analyse, process, learn and put themselves in someone else's shoes in order to help solve problems. But, because what is normally considered as hard work is usually physical labour or something that others can see from the outside, this kind of hard work of the mind and emotions is often overlooked or criticised. They can also be shut down and laughed at because people do not understand them or they for some reason get triggered. When someone compliments or thanks introverts for their advice and insights, it helps them feel like they did something right and that they are actually helping people. It also makes them feel understood, at least on some level. If you thank an introvert for their insight, it is guaranteed to make their day. Number 6. I feel so comfortable around you. Introverts love being told how comfortable and peaceful others feel around them. They feel good providing that space where people can just be themselves without expectations. It is not something that is given much by society, because it always wants people to fulfill certain predetermined roles. But that can be toxic on many levels. Plus, if they feel peace, it means that they are healing and that the introvert is a part of that healing. In a society where everything is fast-paced and there is little to no rest, it is easy to be run down and wounded. It's not easy to heal from all of that. For many, it is an honour to know that they are providing a safe place for others to get away from their tumultuous day-to-day -day and heal. Number 7. You were or are right. Introverts, with their constant thought, are often able to see things before others. 
However, when they express these ideas, they're sometimes ignored or shunned. Then, when those possibilities do come true, they either get people mad at us, ignore us completely, or they just can't find the courage to tell them, I told you so. This kind of treatment makes many introverts keep things to themselves in order to protect themselves from backlash. When you acknowledge, with sincerity and a good heart, that they were right all along, it helps them realize that not everyone will react negatively to what they have to say. Number 8. You can go whenever you'd like. One thing introverts hate is going somewhere with no way of getting out of it once they get drained or overstimulated. A lot of people don't understand that introverts don't thrive or get energy from other people. Instead, they're more likely to be drained. To have someone that says they can go back home whenever they like makes them feel seen and loved as well. Number 9. I'm here for you. Introverts are very good at being there for others all the time, but not very good at being there for themselves, nor are they good at letting other people in to help them. Hearing for the first time that someone is there for them whenever they need does take a lot of weight off their shoulders and reminds them that they don't have to do everything alone. These are just a few things that introverts would like to hear once in a while. What did you think? Do you relate to any of these? Let us know in the comments. Did you find this video valuable? Tell us in the comments below. Please like and share it with friends that might find use in this video too. Make sure to subscribe to Psych2Go and hit the notification bell for more content. All the references used are added in the description box below. Thank you for watching. See you next time.